Gunshots were fired in the middle of the storm. Bullets sent two children to the hospital. You can actually see the bullet hole right there in the side of this home. This happened just before one o'clock at a home in Fayetteville. WRL's Gilbert Bays talked with neighbors who say the shooting has them on edge. Well, that shooting happened at this house here on Plum Street while that tropical storm was passing through. I talked with several neighbors who said they heard the shots ring out. Bullet holes mark the spot where at least three rounds entered this home on Plum Street, two in the side of the building, one through a front window. Tony Floyd lives three doors down. He says he heard the shots through the howling wind of last night's tropical storm. I just woke up and the only thing I heard was like a gunshot. I was like, wow. So I was like, this doesn't make any sense. Police wrapped the house in yellow crime scene tape and spent several hours collecting evidence in and outside of the home. The only thing that we can gather as of right now that it was a shooting that happened outside of the residence. So someone shot into the home and that's where you have a where a 10 year old juvenile and a 15 year old juvenile was struck by gunfire. Those two victims were taken to Cape Fear Valley Medical Center for treatment. And while police search for a suspect, the shootings have neighbors on edge. These young kids just don't know what life is about. I mean, life is not here to stay. You know, you're using it. You know, God can take it at any moment. So why are we killing each other? So this shooting is still under investigation. Fayetteville police asking anyone that knows anything about what happened out here to give them a call. In Fayetteville, Gilbert Bays, WRL News. And we are told the two children are in fair condition. Police are still trying to identify a suspect and a motive for the shooting.